Hello and welcome to episode five of Wild Weather Wonders, where each episode we take questions sent in from viewers like you and we answer them. So today's question comes from Matthew Wheeler down in Sarasota, Florida. And the question is, what is the rarest weather warning our office has put out? And I thought that was a fantastic question, Matthew, um, because I myself have only been here since January of last year. So I was also curious what was the rarest weather warning our office has put out. And of course, all of our minds went straight to, well, have we put out any winter weather warnings, like for winter storms or wind chill, you know, anything like that? Because obviously in Florida, that would be pretty rare. So I asked lots of people in my office what they thought was the rarest weather warning that our office has put out. And a lot of them honed in on the same warning. Um, so we'll talk a little bit about that. But first I wanted to show you guys some of the different warnings that we can put out. Okay, just to give you an idea of all the different types of warnings and advisories the National Weather Service can put out, I've got a comprehensive list here of all the different categories broken down. So this would be all the winter weather advisories and warnings, including blizzard warnings all the way down to like frost advisories. Um, you've got fire weather, that includes the red flag warnings, uh, fog, wind, and severe. And of course, right here you have marine, so, and all the different types of flooding, so coastal flooding, flash flood warnings, uh, river flood warnings, all that kind of stuff, excessive heat, and down at the very bottom you have tropical, tropical storms, hurricanes, that kind of stuff. So before we talk about the rarest weather warning our office has put out, I thought it would be kind of neat to see what kind of warnings or advisories we put out the most. So since 2009, this list was compiled and it's the top 25. Um, so at number one is actually the marine warnings because you know we do have a very large coast in our area all the way from Levy County down to Lee County. So marine warnings would be number one. And then right below that is actually red flag warnings. Um, down at the very bottom, number 25, Tropical Storm Watch. Okay, so let's answer the question of what is the rarest weather warning our office has put out. So there's actually two parts to this answer because our first thoughts were something winter related. So I looked into that information first and in our database I found that we have issued only three wind chill warnings since 2005. And you can kind of see here where most of them have been issued up in the north. So for our criteria, that would be temperatures or the wind chill index of 10 degrees or less for our northern counties, 20 degrees or less for the rest of the counties. And that's over like a period of three hours. Now, obviously the criteria for like northern states would be way different than for Florida. Um, you're talking like negatives for them. So that's the first part. So the other thing I thought was interesting about the wind chill warning is that the last time we issued it was 4,518 days ago. So the second part of the answer and the answer that I got from a lot of people in the office that have been here for a while was the extreme wind warning that we put out for Hurricane Ian. Now notice there is a five in there, meaning we put five out. Um, that was because we put out five for Hurricane Ian because we had to keep updating it. And every time you update it, you gotta put out a new one. Um, and the reason that's so rare is one, it's kind of a newer product. And for two, the criteria for that is you have to have winds of 115 miles per hour or greater sustained as a hurricane is moving on shore within the next hour. And to give you an idea of what that warning looked like, this was Hurricane Ian um, as it was making landfall. And this was the box that we drew up for the extreme wind warning to really give these people an idea of what was heading their way. Well, Matthew, I hope that answered your question about what the rarest weather warning is that our office has sent out. And if you have a question, be sure to send it in with the Google form down below and make sure you subscribe to the video so that way you can get the next one when it comes out. What do you call a grizzly bear in the rain? A drizzly bear.